the thinking pioneer of the ageless Aquarius. It is now the age of Aquarius. <coughs> this is Sinopa Lumbiel, and I would like to share with you a brief introduction about my star regalia, Alpha Lenticulae. <coughs> this constellation of stars is also known as Beta Ansaris, or Ansar, the little fox with the beak. <coughs> As a fiscal adult, I received solar eclipse endowments from these same stars in the same option, and I, and I can rely on Alpha Lenticulae as my spiritual regalia and needed guidance, my higher self-image, and into the fourth and fifth dimension. I believe that every human has a higher self and a regalia star. You should spiritually attach yourself to a constellation for guidance. Dear ones, I can't help but to wonder about star constellations in general. What if our consciousness of them can be something much more than them just being stars? <coughs> I'm starting to think that we came here to expand our celestial consciousness and to help bring a different frequency into Earth. The year 2012 and with the recent ascension shift is a total erasing of the Earth the ending of the old time paradigm. We are the ones who will choose to change the frequency for our Mother Earth. <coughs> However, people who are born on the astrological signs of being Gemini, Virgo, and Aquarius may in fact recognize the sacred astrological regalia a bit faster than even the other zodiac signs. <coughs> but it is because these constellations take full human form